We are three points off Real Madrid, two points off Barcelona. They both have a match in hand, but I'll be darned if we don't play both of those teams on this stream here today. Right next to each other, actually. We looked it up. There are two matches with them are like right next to each other. We've got an opportunity to try and do something special with Sevilla. All right, we got the Champions League knockout, so we got the Copa del Rey semifinal, and now we've got 12 matches left in the league, one against Barcelona, one against Real Madrid, and if everybody wins all their matches in hands, we are six points off the top of the league right now, so we are right there. The chance to just kick the door, and you've thrown a swift kick to the door, to knock the door down and grab a La Liga title. I, I think that the match engine in FM23 is a massive improvement. The problem is it just has a few kinks few little kinks in the hose they got to work out and if they can work those out i do think it's a really nice improvement for the match engine but oh mamma mia I, oh, it's always in the saves you're not going to play for 20 years right always and then they're just like oh by the way here's this fabulous collection of players Finally got Fatinha putting the ball in the back of the net on Friday, and now, now we finally get the Monday. We get to see if he can do it again. Ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous. All right, Hitafe away. Has to be, if we're going to win the league, I mean, we've got to win probably 11 or 12 of the last 14 matches that we're playing. So this has to be a good result for us. Tecatito. Tecatito. Slip him. Oh, dude, there was an obvious, there was an obvious pass there, man. To Vitinha, man. Boo! It's right. <laughs> no, no, for this stupid boo thing. What am I doing? Led Tasso. Zed Lasso, I prefer. It's obvious penalty. Uh, fabulous penalty take by Papu Gomez. We're getting very fortunate in this game. That was embarrassingly bad. And then... Tangi Nyansu has the recovery speed to get there anyway. I wonder if my tactic from last year would work. Our team's not built for that, obviously. First season. All right, you got to build a team for that tactic over time. I wonder if it would work. Start using it. Sell all your wingers. Oh, what a pass! Pedro Gazzoli! <laughs> Can't wait for the road to glory to win save in Norway. Oh, the Vikings, yes. Parabolic, thanks to the two. Keeper Moore scored two against Spurs. Oh my goodness, we scored. Oh, I was reading your message, Parabolica. That's something special. So it's either Kemri or Kumri. That's, uh, you know, at least we're, we're, we've zeroed in. We've zeroed in on the way it's supposed to be pronounced, and I appreciate that. I can at least say it without completely embarrassing myself. Uh, well done, good win. Clap it up, chat. Clap it up, chat. We've won our first match of the stream. Easy does it. And Barcelona dropped some points there, Sailor. Barcelona's only two points ahead of us right now. Hi, Barcaluni. We're reeling you in. Uh, Pedro Gonsalves, I will... I will. I will try to rest you for two games. It's possible Before I won't be able to resist the urge, but I will try. asked if I'd like to be knocked out. <sighs> Uh, we are away to the 17th team in the league. These are the type of matches we have to take care of in order to pressure for La Liga here at the end of the season. Peles. Oh, Tecatito. Yes! Come on! <laughs> Chat. I don't want to alarm anybody, but he actually lo he looks pretty good right now. Vitinha, all of a sudden, after not scoring for seven games, is on fire. Uh, Skinny, thank you for the prime. Welcome to the Hammers. Enjoy the bacon. Enjoy the emotes. You don't get in the subsection of the Discord. You got it for free. Almost as if he needed time to adapt to the team. You know what, JLab? You know what? Some people are able to get going right away, all right? Maybe he's not Erling Holland, but I, maybe he was. Thank you. I'm embarrassed for you after that effort. Goal! 
Our defense is good. That was a huge issue for us most of this year. Tangini Anzu. Ilya Zabarni, Kareem Racking. No! Barca scored! Dang it. Ah, oh, Bar Barcaluni scored right at the death there. Oh, how much more difficult is this game? I don't know if it's more difficult. I mean, it's all... Oh, yes, 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 yes. Real Madrid with the draw. We are gaining points all over the place, chat. Very clear top three in the league, you know. It's us, Real Madrid and Barcelona. Four points off the top of the league. I know a lot of you probably tuned in today like, there's no way, right? There's no way he actually is going to... He, he thinks he can win the league today. I, I absolutely do. If you can win your last 10 games, you'll win the league. No problem, boss. No problemo. 10 games. We're away to Atletico Madrid. But we just won two matches on the road, so we're feeling pretty good here. I think we actually have everybody. That's one of the first times all season. I am a glass case of emotion. Where's Delaney? It's a tricky game. Our team selection is right, but... No Tecatito. He's he's really our best, like, I run with the ball type of guy. My three, uh, my 4-3-3 three, three is better than your 4-3-3. Three, three. It's my favorite game to play. We beat him at home. We beat him, like, 4 to nothing when we played them at home. Uh, okay. Carry forward from your last match. We will be fine. Obviously, it's going to be a big bumper atmosphere, but they're having a terrible year. I didn't know their form was that bad. I knew they were having a terrible year. Awesome sauce. Thanks to the Prime. Oh, yeah. Just take him to school. You're faster than this guy. Why are you going inside? Oh, Vitinha. Oh, my God. This is Vitinha. He's white hot, lads. Four consecutive matches, and he scored in, and Vitinha with Grand Theft Football on the back line. Fabulous finishing. Oh, Rekic, yes, Delaney, yes. Papu, yes, Sabitz, oh, Vitinha. What a freaking muscle show from Vitinha. I really appreciate Alex Telles slowing down so that that guy could stay ahead of him on the wing. Navas, very good defending there, son. I just called him, a, I just called him son, he's like 80 years old, come on. Murata striking like lightning as usual. Oh, Murata. Goodness. Okay, sorry. Um, it's just too perfect. Okay. We, we just turned the ball over so many times, there was no way we weren't going to get punished for that. There's no way this guy ends up on this ball. Now we have a lot of options for this. There we go, Vitinha. I have my plan. Oh, we can go get this. That's what we need. All right, Nianzu. This is a time to score. Oh, no, no, no. <sighs> Running the ball back well enough. We're just not like we can't. The pass is there, dude. What are we doing? What are we doing? I mean, the pass is there on the like. The consistency with which we are failing to make these passes with players that are so good at passing is frustrating me beyond belief. This is, this is a very tough loss here against a team that was not playing well. Like, we can't do anything. We cannot get into the final third of the field in this game. 
We could not get into the final third of the field. Everybody, Gonsalves, Tecatito, Lamella, everybody had a terrible game. Our ball carriers, terrible. And that really hurts. Oh, we were really on to something as a team there. And then we started that game so well. And then we just... I mean, you look at the match momentum. The, mid the middle of the game was just all them. We got it back for a little bit. Who should I be on the FM, in my FM23 beta save? Just go for a nice short-term challenge. Something to really test you. In the short term, but not something you're going to be like, well, I need to continue it now. But you're right, because you, you can't you can't, and you should not do that. Honestly, it might, yeah, that was just a bad match. We, we were unbeaten in 12 before that loss. We'd won all of our matches going in. Oh, shoot. Oh, Yavitania is on. Good. Goal! Right in front of you. Oh, Lamella. Yeah. Oh. oh. Freaking mid celebration already. Just going to keep winning. You never know what can happen if you just get. Oh, get in, Nick. Oh, yes. Somebody got it. It's Lamella. It's only his second goal of the year with his right foot. No way. No way. What was the Athletic of Madrid score? They grabbed a late one to make it three to one. All right, now we're in, we're, I'm in my mustache era. Honestly, I just haven't remembered to shave it, which doesn't sound true, but if you know me, you know it is. Can you name me one instance in real life where the majority of a locker room mutinied because they felt that there was a lack of depth in a position? I can't, I, I mean, the other stuff that people mutiny about, you know, playing time, uh, transfers, the normal things, right? Being promised a certain amount of playing time or being promised to play in a certain position or being promised to play a, as a penalty taker. Like those things are things that people mutiny about in real life. Yeah, or yeah, because of the, the tactic in general. Right? And the, oh, we're not playing the right way or whatever. Good win. I mean, we had to win that. It was home against the worst team in the league, and we did win it. So good effort by the lads. We just need Real Madrid and Barcelona to... Oh, they're playing each other. Give me a draw. Oh, give me a draw. Oh, give me a draw. It was the Spanish Cup. Zealand, can you read? Barcelona won the Spanish Cup on penalties. Dang it. Match rearranged with Real Madrid. Oh, let's go. Does that make it like the last match of the season? No. But it did now give us a full week, I think. I, I don't know. I think it just gave us a full week of prep and rest for Barcelona and for Real Madrid, which is great because they won't have that. Never let the dream die. Keep the dream alive. Madrid lost because they played in the Champions League three days before in the Copa del Rey six days before they've got a lot of stuff to deal with we don't Rekic better get through all three of these games I am not playing Marcal all right this should be the easy one it's the only home one out of the three but we got to take it one match at a time and we just got to get on the field and get three points every time we can Pedro Gonzalez Sabitzer, ooh, running ball for Suso, who's finally back from his injury. Pedro Gonzalez, yeah! Let's go! Ball was just a bit behind him. Oh, Telles! Oh, oh, oh. oh my word, Alex Telles! Where did that come from? The loney fullback with a rocket launch in Sevilla Stadium. Try and list them in the same message. Oh, that's a foul. How? He didn't touch the ball. And he's offside. How, what much did they pay you? How much did they pay you? Put it in the back of the net, son. Oh, it's a Borne to Vitinha, and it's in. Goal! He scores for fun. He scores for fun. Vitinha is the one. Silva. Why, David? Retire. Be with your family, David. Leave me alone. 
Oh, what a touch! Oh, what a run! Oh, what a goal! And got a Suso! Out of nowhere! What a fabulous goal! From Suso! He just went around everybody and just tapped it in. Just tap it in. Come on, lads! Hopefully that puts a little pressure on Barcelona. Yeah, I know they've got two matches in hand on us, but we are now ahead of them in the league. We have acquired more points than they have. Tricky, tricky slate of two games coming up. Are only two wins away from a record number of wins at the club. That's fun. We've won 22 matches this season. We're definitely going to get two more wins this year because we have that really easy run in at the all Barcelona drew. Real Madrid won. That's okay. They were playing a bad team. But Barcelona drew. And that, br that brings us ever closer. Real Madrid's four points ahead. Barcelona is three points ahead. We are the only team not playing in Europe, if I remember correctly. They both still have European ties coming up. They Oh, their match against me is sandwiched by matches against Manchester United. That is our side. With the higher press, with the get stuck in, absolutely. They've got Giovanni Lo Celso. Make sure you get in the subsection of the Discord to take full advantage of being part of an elite online gaming community. That. Oh, we were there, Gonzalo Vish. Yes, Tecatito, Tecatito! Goal! The Mexican aerospace engineer engineers his fifth goal of the season. He finally didn't hit a moonshot, and you know why? Because he didn't actually have to shoot it. He just had to walk around the goalkeeper and pass us in. Uh, oh, come on, bro. Whoa, why did we commit to that? Oh, goodness, Navas, you're scaring me with this whole back across the goal thing. Oh, Pedro Gonsalves. Oh, oh what a run, Ref. dude. What a player. Back the net. Hey! Goal! That was a fantastic performance. That is a fantastic win. Just keeping the pressure on. Cranking out win after win after win. We beat Villarreal. The yellow submarine is sinking. It's really not. They're having a good year, but... Oh, wow. Villarreal losing again. Not good for them. Letting Atletico Madrid right back into it. Elta Vigo actually is getting back into it. Elche sailing up the table recently. Oh, Okay. Can't worry about what everybody else is doing. We just got to worry about what we're doing. And that is resting Pedro Gonçalves. We need Jesus Navas for the next match. So Gonzalo Montiel, you're going out there. We do not want um, Navas picking up a yellow in this match. But then again, every match is important. Every match is crazy important now. What's the XG on that, you think? Negative 0.01. Well, that's a troubling spot. So tell me this. I want to look at the way that we set up to defend this, right? It's very clearly a five-man zone. All right, very clearly. We're looking at a five-man zone. We've got the extra man marker and then the top-of-the-box player right there. All right, that is our corner defense for absolutely no reason. And it doesn't act the same way as our corner defense. The reason I know that's our corner defense is because we have set up our indirect wide and it's all people on go back that should be finding a man instead of doing that. Maybe you consider that an indirect deep. Maybe you consider that a direct where we have player mark set up. It actually uses your corner tactic in those positions. And I think that is ridiculous because it doesn't tell you that it's going to do that. And it doesn't react to the free kick the same way. And now that I've made really extensive changes to my free kick defense, we can finally completely confirm that's what's happening. That's the first time I've been able to, like, actually show it. But that is what's happening there. It pulls your corner defense, even though it doesn't react the same way to free kicks. I 
I was so busy proving that we just gave up a goal in the meantime. And I think that we don't have a lot of options, but Adnan Yanisai is going to stat. Yeah, four halftime changes. Suffice it to say, we were not satisfied with our first half performance. We would like a little bit of an adjustment. Thank you. Love the immediate highlight. I think we sent the right message by making four substitutions. Nice pass. Teles on the move. Good into Pedro Gonçalves. Well, I mean, still. So. anything to say you might be wondering if i have something that i want to add to what you just witnessed i don't you have to follow that run you can't stop now you now you know nobody's doing anything right like you can't stop following this run just because you're like oh he's too deep for my position now so watch as nabil fakir continues to uh elude alex tellis at least he gave him some healthy space. You know, I'm a big believer in providing personal space for people. How many Sevilla players is it? Oh my goodness. Nice, Nick. It's there. I think Gonsalves is on. He's just running in quicksand right now, so. Nice. All the way, you know, to the second goal we conceded. To the red card, just a freaking mess of a game. Absolute mess of a game. Can't win consistently on the road. We cannot win consistently on the road. That might have, that might have sunk us. I know we thought the last one sunk us, but that might have that might have sunk the ship there. there. There's no ifs, ands, or buts. There's no room for draws. We need to win this game. If we do, and then we go out and we beat Barcelona, of course there is every chance of us being able to win the league. But it is a very tall mountain for us to climb. Both matches are at home against Real Madrid and Barcelona. If there's one silver lining in that for us it's that both matches are at home oh and that they play today and i really hope that they lose i mean it is real batiste the team that just gave us all sorts of problems and they well they did just play benzema and venetius jr so did barcelona win yeah okay so that's trouble we're six and seven points back it happened barcelona lost to valencia that means we win this match we are three points off barcelona going into a match against barcelona and four points off of real madrid with four matches to go and they have a bunch of champions league stuff and we don't can i set him as a roaming playmaker allow him to fill a few more spots instead of staying completely anchored on the backside. who do they have everybody good they have everybody we exact revenge. I have faith in you. There we go. You've inspired a few folks. This is for the. This is to keep us alive for the title right now. Barcelona is lost. If we are going to go, we can't keep folding. We have to go now. This is the season. We've had an amazing season. We're on pace to break some serious records for this club, but. If we're going to go and steal the title from Barcelona and Real Madrid, we have to go now. where for 25 minutes we were oh come on you're gonna give me whatever that was from racket in a penalty right now that's what you're gonna give me absolutely not 
He's probably, it's probably a pen. Oh, wow. I'm, I'm very, I'm very surprised that he didn't call that based off the animation. That, that looked clean. Bono, Bono, we need a big save. Oh, he was on it too. Why can't we play against this team? But they're going to get tired. They played three days ago and they used a lot of the same players. Gasolvish, let's go, Pedro. Oh, no! It deflected into his back. On position marking wise, we have been the better team in the second half, but we need to make that count. Now, boss. Gasolvish! Yes! Yes, yes, yes! Oh, goodness. Okay. Oh, ref! 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 Yes! That was body! That was body! He was in! Ref! Oh, come on! Oh, come on! I just say come on enough times, something good will happen. You really can't counter corners at all in this game. Oh, come on, dude. None of the three goals have had anything to do with me! Why? FM Guts! I had a tight mark on a 36 year old who can barely freaking move! <laughs> oh man. Let's watch this master class here. I, I actually think our tactic worked really well in this game. I... That nutmeg was filthy? You mean the nutmeg that was going two miles an hour? No, that's match engine, dude. I'm not buying that. I'm not buying that for a second. That ball was moving so slow. Like, the match engine decided that he was supposed to be able to get by Telus in that situation. Just the way that it showed it was just... I don't know what we could have done there. The first... From the first goal where Rekic just, like, hit it right to Benzema to... Oh, uh, we... we I don't know what it is. I don't know what it is. It might be the way that we're mentally handling the matches or something. Like I mean, like, managing the mentality of the players. But we cannot play against Barcelona or Real Madrid. I'm going to not tight mark. All right, we tight marked three different guys in that last match, and I, I wonder if that did contribute at least to the first goal we conceded where we jumped ourselves out of position. Okay, Barcelona. Now, this is the one that we just don't necessarily take seriously. Just kind of throw our team together. Um, see, we're up to our old tricks. But hey, Delaney. Good. Very good, Thomas. Very good play. Very. Oh, wow. Okay. I, I was so. I, I was fairly certain that ball was going to the back of the net there, Vitinha. Yo, guys, get that new highlight out there. New Encourage just dropped. Lock it. Oh, my goodness. Barcelona has never seen passing like this before. Oh, my goodness. Oh, yes. Jesus Navas, Casalves, always in for a good first touch. Vitecatito into the post. Oh. That tandem may be giving us an opportunity to... Oh, yes, Delaney. They are pressing. They're pressing for the goal, and that gives us the chance. We're just going to be able to counter as long as we keep those three attacking guys up there. Papu! Hit the ball, son! Playing into space. Making them defend towards their goal because bad things happen. Tecatito. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, okay. We're going like, oh my, he was a mile and a half away from that ball. You have got to be kidding me. Are they nerfed the amount of his brain cells? Like, what are you talking about?
Wait, did he just decide not to play advantage on that last play? Because we were in. We just have, we have one center back I don't hate. And his name's Ilya Zabarny. Every other center back on this team is just so bad. And we have somehow managed to get to this point in the season with those guys in our team, but they are all bad. And Tangini Anzu has been single-handedly responsible, uh, combined with Kareem Rakic for the majority of the goals we've conceded in the last two matches. That's brutal. I don't know. We're just clearly the third place team in the league. We can't touch those other... That was the best we played against Barcelona or Real Madrid all year. And it still didn't work. So... I want to give him a rest one time. I love how just awful we've been to start this game. 41% possession, no shots, and yet, oh. lucky eight ball dude there's no remedy i have for us just not being able to do anything with a pretty offensive formation against a bad team jesus navas just stood in place for five seconds and then somehow has recovered anyways and then passed it to the wrong team so that we got scored on oh should have been scored on my bad and we uh, i mean that Rats. is a clear penalty that we will take i to make sure you have the right taker Okay, Alex Telles. Thank you. Unbelievable. I don't I don't even believe that that just happened. I can't even believe that that just happened. That team, it, it, like, okay, if you get FM, you have 3XG, right? And then, now, they kind of almost deserve that draw. It's going to be fun. Okay, we will watch our lead midfielder, as is custom. That's Delaney, right? No, it's Sabitzer, I guess, so. Ice pass, go to Solve. Yo. Yo. Oh, goodness. Okay, yeah, that's, we'll take that. Composed from Marcel Sabitzer. Oh, he's in. Vitinha. Well done. Well done, son. Well done. Thank you. And we have tied the all-time wins record at Sevilla in our first season. 24 league wins. Vamos, Sevilla. A, a gutsy 3-2 win away is the way I would describe that. A gutsy 3-2 win. We have... Come within a, 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 you know, a breath of setting the severe record for most points and most wins in a season. And then to do that, we need to beat Almeria. We are chasing the record today. <sighs> in a 
inexplicably, Asus Navas blocks Niansu's clearance out for a corner. Man, our defense is something at the end of this season, huh? Nice sub it, sir. All right, Papu. Great touch. Great goal. goal. Well, we come, we've come from behind a truly ridiculous number of times this season. I don't see why we wouldn't do it in the final match. It's more like a ball-playing defender now that I've taken him off it. That's very good. That is very, very good. That's beautiful. Can I run this play more often? I would love to run this play. Can I just, please, can I run that play? That being said, Tangy, this would be a great time for you to be especially tall. Tangy Neonzo! Yes! 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 Tangy Neonzo! And this is the record-breaking Sevilla side! A 25th victory in the league of play for Sevilla! At the death, Tengi Nyansu gets both hands on history! Fabulous! Domineering goal from Tengi Nyansu! We got the result. Despite not being at our best, we were far from our best. We didn't give them a good goal scoring chance the second half. We got 80 points, which ties the all time points record for Sevilla. We got 25 wins and 38 matches, which is the record for Sevilla and a fabulous season.